Today isn't just any ordinary Tuesday. It's Fashnat Day, okay, that gives us all permission to eat as many donuts as you can handle. Our Joseph Omo is in Hagerstown today. He has that story. How do we pronounce it? Fosnut. Fosnut. This is the best place to come and get your Fosnuts. What did you just call me? Fosnut. It might be tough to pronounce, but boy, it sure is easy to eat. A Fosnut is this little sugary delight that's so special, it even gets its own day of the year. We can only make so many, so they rush in to get, get them while they can. Yeah, how about 72,000 of them? That's how many Crumpies makes in just a two-day span. It comes out to roughly 120 dozen every hour. The shop up in Hagerstown is the true definition of a family business, a donut making tradition that's gone on for generations. And today we spoke to several of those family members about what is one of the most important days of the year for them. Fastnacht is uh, a German word means fast night and it's the night before Ash Wednesday. Oh, okay. And it was, it's a pretty much a Pennsylvania Dutch tradition. Throughout history, uh, right before Lent, everyone would use up all their sugars and their lard and their uh, different spices, you know, getting into spring and, and, and right before Lent. So uh, they'd make a special doughy treat yeah and that's what a false knot is this couple even jogging to the shop to buy their false knots and yeah we ran over we don't live that far away we're about two miles away or so we ran over figured we would grab our donuts and run them back on home a sweet tradition that means nothing without community crumpies is like a local institution and family i think that was his very first shop and uh says rm crumpy proprietor great oh yeah oh yeah my face is already messy, but oh yeah, yep. very good. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. Reporting in Hagerstown, Joseph Olmo, DC News Now. And they are so delicious. Chris, yeah. I have to thank you for saving me a glaze. Yeah, and Joe Olmo with, with really tough gig today. Yeah. But he came back with a box load of them. So 11 uh, boxes. Yeah. <laughs> 11 <laughs> boxes. Broke a so. record. <laughs> Best so Joe, nuts. thank you. Yeah. <laughs> all right, we got Chief Meteorologist Janessa Webby. We've got to walk off the donuts. That's right. Get out there this <laughs> evening and walk them off, Janessa. Hopefully the weather will cooperate. The problem is you all see my face right now. I didn't get a donut. Nobody saved me a donut. Uh, <laughs> uh, we had my donut. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take another oh, one too. <laughs> man. Yeah, well, if you need to walk off those donuts tonight, it's uh, going to be fairly blustery across uh, the DMV.